Welcome to Tech Nation. In this video, we are going to talk about the top 15 unmanned vehicles. So, before starting this video, like this video and subscribe to Tech Nation for future updates. An uncrewed vehicle or unmanned vehicle is a vehicle without a person on board. Uncrewed vehicles can either be remote controlled or remote guided vehicles, or they can be autonomous vehicles, which are capable of sensing their environment and navigating on their own. Here are the top 15 unmanned vehicles in the world. Number 15, Zephyr Stratospheric UAW. Zephyr is a new solar electric stratospheric UAW offered by Airbus Defense and Space, also referred to as the High Altitude Pseudo Satellite, HAPS, HAPS. The aircraft hovered for more than 25 days during its maiden flight, conducted in the third quarter of 2018. Zephyr will be offered in two versions, namely Zephyr S and Zephyr T. The Zephyr S is the production model with a 25 meter wingspan and a weight of less than 75 kilograms. While Zephyr T is a larger version currently under development, it will have a 33 meter wingspan and a maximum weight of 140 kilograms. The unmanned aircraft can fly for months continuously. It acts as a persistent surveillance platform similar to a satellite while offering the flexibility of a UAV. Equipped with two solar-powered electric motors, the Zephyr UAV can fly at a maximum altitude of 70,000 feet. Number 14. Global Observer Stratospheric Persistent UAS The Global Observer is a stratospheric persistent UAS designed to serve in defense and homeland security missions. UAS can carry communications, relay, and remote sensing payloads for military or commercial customers. Aerovironment developed the Global Observer under the Joint Capability Technology Demonstration, JCTD, program. Making its first flight in August of 2010, the UAS completed its first hydrogen-powered flight in January of 2011. The UAS is equipped with liquid hydrogen-fueled propulsion and can loiter in the air for up to one week or 168 hours. The system can operate at high altitudes of up to 65,000 feet, covering more than 280,000 square miles and carry payloads of up to 181 kilograms or 400 pounds. Number 13, Orion Unmanned Aircraft System, UAS. Orion is a long-endurance UAS developed by Aurora Flight Sciences for Intelligent Surveillance and Reconnaissance, ISR, and Communication Relay Missions. Developed for the same program as the Global Observer, the Orion UAS has been selected as the preferred option by the U.S. Air Force for its JCTD program. The Orion UAS completed its first flight in August of 2013. It can carry multiple payloads of 2,600 pounds, including full motion video electro optic infrared EOIR sensor communication relay equipment, radars, signal intelligence, and wide area airborne surveillance equipment. The wing hardpoints of Orion can also be mounted with munitions. The dual Astro engine AE300 heavy fuel engines fitted in the Orion UAS ensure a high endurance of five days or more than 120 hours with a 1,000 pound payload. The UAS has a dash speed of 120 kilometers and ferry range of 24,140 kilometers. It can fly at a maximum altitude of 30,000 feet. Number 12, United 40 Smart I2 UAV. United 40 or Smart I2 is a medium altitude long endurance male UAW developed by ADCOM Systems, a company based in the UAE. The UAV made its public presence at the Dubai Air Show 2011. The maiden flight was conducted in March 2013. The UAV can be used to conduct near real time assessment of combat and battle damage, ISR, communications relay, border surveillance, and humanitarian aid missions. The UAV's wings have a high aspect ratio, resulting in an ultra-long endurance of 120 hours. The United 40 can carry 1,000 kilograms of payload, including two gyro-stabilized platforms, Synthetic Aperture Radar, SAR, and Terrain and Obstacle Avoidance, Sonar. The four underwing pods can each hold 100 kilograms. The hybrid propulsion system, equipped with a Rotax 914 engine and an electric motor, provides a maximum speed of 75 kilometers an hour to 220 kilometers an hour at an altitude of 22,965 feet. Number 11, Yebon Smart Eye UAV. 
The Yabon Smart Eye Mail UAV, built by Adcom Systems, is intended for strategic and tactical missions. The UAV was displayed first at the International Defense Exhibition and Conference, IDEX 2009. The Smart Eye UAV can stay airborne for 120 hours. It can carry payloads of up to 550 kilograms, including IR, thermal imager, laser designator, and range finder, LDFR, and EO sensors. Its Advanced Flight Control Unit, FCU, ensures autonomous operation. The propulsion is provided by a primary propeller engine complemented by a secondary jet engine to enhance performance. The UAV has a maximum speed of 222 kilometers an hour and can reach a maximum altitude of 24,000 feet. Number 10, Huron Medium Altitude Long Endurance Mail. UAS Huron is a multi-role mail UAS manufactured by Israel Aerospace Industries, IAI. The UAS is operated by more than 20 customers for intelligence, surveillance, maritime patrol, and other tactical missions. The Huron USA can carry multiple sensor payloads such as EO, IR, LRF, communications intelligence, and electronic intelligence communications relay and radar systems. It uses a direct line of sight data link or beyond line of sight, BLOS, with SATCOM to communicate with the ground control station. The mission payload can weigh up to 400 kilograms. The UAS has an endurance of up to 45 hours based on the payload. It can fly at a maximum speed of 120 kilometers and can reach an altitude of more than 30,000 feet. The propulsion is provided by a Rotax 914 turbocharged engine. Number 9. MQIC Gray Eagle Extended Range MQIC Gray Eagle Extended Range is an advanced version of the combat-proven Gray Eagle UAS developed by General Atomic Aeronautical Systems. The UAV made its first flight in October 2016. The unmanned aircraft has a maximum endurance of 42 hours and can be deployed in long endurance intelligence, surveillance and target acquisition, communications relay and combat missions. It has a maximum takeoff weight of 4,200 pounds. The UAV is launched using an automatic takeoff and landing system powered by a high performance 180 horsepower diesel engine. The GEER UAV can fly at a maximum speed of 167 KTAS and reach a maximum altitude of 29,000 feet. Number 8. MQ-1 Predator UAS The MO-1 Predator UAS built by General Atomic Aeronautical Systems is the most battle-proven unmanned aircraft system in the world. The UAS is in service with the Italian Air Force, Turkish Air Force, UAE Air Force, and the Royal Moroccan Air Force. It was used in combat missions over Afghanistan, Pakistan, Bosnia, Serbia, Iraq, Yemen, Libya, and Somalia. The Predator has an endurance of 40 hours and is the first ever armed UAS capable of delivering precision air-to-surface weapons. It can carry 340 kilograms in multiple payloads, including EOIR video cameras, laser designators, communications relay, SIG INT ESM systems, Lynx multiple mode all-weather radar, and Hellfire missiles. The UAS is controlled from the ground control station through C-band LOS data link and Q-band SATCOM. The power plant consists of a heavily modified Rotax 914 turbo engine, providing a maximum airspeed of 120 kilometers. The maximum altitude the UAS can reach is 25,000 feet. Number 7. Hermes 900 male UAS. The Hermes 900 is an advanced multi-role male unmanned aircraft system manufactured by Elbit Systems. The UAS is used in persistent intelligence, surveillance, target acquisition, and reconnaissance missions. The Hermes 900 completed its maiden flight in December 2009. It can endure airborne for a maximum of 36 hours. It is in service with the Israeli Air Force, Chilean Air Force, Colombian Air Force, and Mexican Federal Police. The UAS can support multiple payload configurations such as EOIR laser designator, SAR ground moving target indicating, GMTI, and maritime patrol radar, and electronic warfare, hyperspectral systems, communications relay, wide area surveillance, and mapping payloads. It is controlled from the Hermes ground control system, GCS, and can fly at a maximum altitude of 30,000 feet. Number six, RQ-4. Global Hawk Hail UAS. 
RQ4 Global Hawk is a Hale UAS produced by Northrop Grumman. The combat-proven UAS is in service with the U.S. Air Force and U.S. Navy. The Global Hawk was deployed in more than 15 combat missions and accumulated 350 combat hours during Operations Enduring Freedom, Southern Watch, and Iraqi Freedom. It has a maximum endurance of over 32 hours and a ferry range of 22,780 kilometers. It can fly at an altitude of 60,000 feet. The Global Hawk set a new endurance record for operational UAS in a nonstop flight of 33.1 hours altitude up to 60,000 feet. The UAS supports different configurations or blocks. The initial Block 10 and Block 20 were substituted with the latest Block 30 and Block 40 configurations. The Euro Hawk, a derivative of the Block 20 Global Hawk, was also developed by Northrop Grumman and EADS for the German Air Force. The Block 40 versions integrate multi-platform MPRTIP active electronically scanned array radar, synthetic aperture radar, and ground-moving target indicator. The UAV employs wideband KU SATCOM and LOS to communicate with the ground station. Number 5. MQ-9 Reaper Predator B This plane was developed by General Atomic Aeronautical Systems to satisfy what the American Air Forces and Navy need. They already participated in several missions in Afghanistan, Iraq, and Africa. Every Reaper can carry up to 14 Hellfire air-to-ground missiles or four Hellfire missiles and 2 by 230 kilogram laser-guided bombs. Number 4. Predator C Avenger it is a more advanced version of Predator B. It has improved electronics, some stealth solutions such as internal weapon storage, and S-shaped exhaust for reducing thermal signature. It can carry the same types of armament as Predator B, but more of it. It is still in the development phase and hasn't participated in military missions. Number 3. Boeing X-45 the unmanned combat air vehicle, UCAV, is a development of Phantom Works, subdivision of Boeing, and manufactured by Boeing Integrated Defense Systems, built in 13 years ago, 2000. It is armed with two weapon bays, with four weapons in each, and is able to wear small bombs. Number 2. Northrop Grumman X-47B Pegasus Following the Boeing's X-45, Pegasus flew in 2011 for the first time. The vehicle has two weapon bays allowing bomb armament with 2,000 kilogram weight. Number one, Black Knight. Surprisingly, this isn't an American project. The tank was developed by BAE Systems and carried no soldiers or inside. But it houses many systems that allow them to make an obstacle avoiding route autonomously and give some autonomous functions to the turret. Armed with 300 millimeter cannons and a machine gun, this is probably the light tank of the future. What do you think of our list? Do let us know in the comment section below. If you like this video and want to hear from us again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go.